The institution that is honoring us today with its award has one of the most important Sephardic libraries in the world. This is an excellent reminder of the deep Spanish-Jewish roots in America and is its law school dedicated to jurist Benjamin Cardoso, the descendant of an illustrious Sephardic family renowned in science, politics, and jurisprudence. As judge of the New York Supreme Court and later associate judge of the United States Supreme Court, Cardozo enriched legal doctrine and jurisprudence, adding to the Anglo-Saxon tradition the fundamental humanism of this own Christian Jewish heritage. Cardozo and his ancestors found in America the promise of this justice for all. His teachings are alive in the conscience of all those who in public service, in private business or academic circles, or in any circumstances as citizens wish to contribute to the ideals of freedom, justice, and peace that define our common culture. Mr. President, I wish to reiterate my sincerest thanks for this honored distinction, which embodies the principles and ideals that guided Judge Cardozo. His example and his memory constitutes the best guarantee for upright, equitable, and generous conduct. May his sense of justice help us to keep the balance between law and ethics, which since the beginning of time has assured the good government of peoples. Thank you very much. None of us was really aware of what the king was going to say in his statement after he received the honorary degree. We never knew or had any idea of the depth and historical significance of that statement. I thought that this would be very inspiring to the students at Cardozo Law School. It meant a lot to the New York Jewish community to see a Jewish institution of uh, such prominence in its own area be recognized in that way by a great world leader. It's a very historic event bringing King Carlos to Yeshiva University, something no one could dream about uh, 200 years ago. He realizes that what he says and what he does means something to the people in Spain, means something to the whole world. Now, if he can do it as leader of a modern Western monarchy, it means that everywhere throughout the world,